Mm -hmm. Should the Eagles be worried? No, because I think at the end of the day, they'll be right in the right in the hunt again. Um, Nick Foles, Skip Bayless, you said Nick Foles is the guy. He, mm -hmm. he uh, Carson Wentz could not have performed better. You mm -hmm. believe Nick Foles is equal to, if not better than Carson Wentz. Yep. Skip, I think the problem that any Super Bowl team has is that they're just a Super Bowl team. Everybody has to worry about injury, Skip. Mm -hmm. Everybody has to worry about somebody having a big year, coming back, trying to replicate that. Plus, teams gear up for you, Skip. They get ready in the offseason. When you come there, the Super Bowl champ, I remember, you know, winning the Super Bowl in Denver, and uh, I'm, I'm on the conference call. And they preface everything, I and mean, you won the Super Bowl last year. Mm -hmm. How do you – okay, we know we won the Super Bowl. That team that we're coming to face, they know we won the Super Bowl. Mm -hmm. They re elevate their level of play. Yep. Fans in the stands. They want to beat the defending Super Bowl champ because that gives them credibility. Mm -hmm. They might not make the playoff, but what can they fall back on? We beat the Super Bowl champ. So, Skip, this is how it works. It's not easy. That's why only one team has done it in the last, what, 20 years. The Patriots did in 03, 04. So, did the Patriots get fat and happy? Did they have a Super Bowl hangover last year because they had an opportunity to repeat? No, it just team played better than mm -hmm. you did that day. Seattle, mm. did they get fat and happy? No. Mm. Patriots played better, made a few more plays. I don't believe Seattle, I don't believe the Philadelphia Eagles got fat and happy. But you do have to guard against injuries. And they mm -hmm. got an injury at the one position that you really don't want to have it at, the quarterback, Skip. Mm -hmm. He had a very serious knee injury. Well, Adrian Peterson, kept, Adrian Peterson didn't tear his AC, uh, uh, mm -hmm. LCL. He tore his ACL and MCL. He did. LCL is a whole different ball game. It is. Mm -hmm. Adrian Peterson also is superhuman. Mm -hmm. that's, that's an anomaly. And see, the, the thing is, Skip, is that you see what AP did? And they try to run. No, 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 no. You can't do what AP did. You're going to take a little longer. But Philly will be just fine. Mm -hmm. They're loaded on defense. Yeah. They, they got a lot of injuries. Alshon is going to miss two or three weeks. Carson's not there. But if Nick Foles is who you said he is, mm -hmm. this shouldn't be a problem. Yeah. It's going to be a problem because Nick Foles is going to play very well tomorrow night against the Falcons, and they're going to win that game because of Nick Foles, and it's going to create more and more of a quarterback quandary as Carson Wentz is cleared to play. And I believe he will be sooner than later. And then what are you going to do, Coach Peterson, Dougie P, as you call him? It depends. What's he, the record? He is choking. He is coming apart. He's coming unglued trying to handle this controversy because he's never been thrust into this kind of spotlight. I'm going to remind you again, just 10 years ago, he was a high school coach in Shreveport, Louisiana. And now he's facing a whole new set of problems. I agree with you on defense. They are loaded. So the defense is going to keep them in a lot of close games. Mm -hmm. Are they going to win those close games? I think they'll lose a few of them depending on who the quarterback is mm -hmm. because I'm going to remind you, just a year ago, Carson Wentz in his rookie year wasn't very good. Dak was really good in his rookie year. Carson really struggled. They went 7-9, and nine, and nobody saw them coming last year. One year ago, right this minute, nobody was picking Philadelphia no. to get to the Super Bowl or win the division, no. right? No. So will they be a playoff team? I think they will. But I don't think they're going to win the division. That's just But the me. NFC is yeah. loaded, Skip. Yeah, it's loaded. You, you go to NFC South, hey, and you if, got Carolina if, and Atlanta if you, and If you Saints. slip just a little bit back across that fine line between mm -hmm. winning and losing, you're going to miss the playoffs. Yeah. You right? got Minnesota Green. People not even talk about the Packers. Mm -hmm. Minnesota Green Bay. You like you like Dallas? Eagles? Mm -hmm. I mean, somebody, somebody's going to be left. Somebody's going to miss. Yeah, somebody's going to be left. And home. Alshon Jeffrey is not available right. right now, and he was their Anquan Bolden last year. Mm -hmm. He was that guy who made that catch at that moment where he's got such a huge radius. He's such he, he's tall and long and strong, and he will snatch it. Right. And he helped Carson Wentz look, to me, a little better than he even deserved to look, and he played great last year. But Alshon was a driving force of this MVP. team as a receiver. Should've okay. MVP. Well, Tom Brady was the MVP. You know what happened. For me. I know what your restaurant said happened. They didn't let Carson Wentz in because they were celebrating Tom Brady night because he was the MVP. Carson got hurt. Yeah. You know that, Skip. Hey, well, that happens. It's football. Well, that's what I'm saying. Yeah. Injuries okay. happen. Okay. So, now one's happened to Alshon. So, Again, will it hurt them over the first few games? I don't know how it's going to play out. I think Nick Foles will play well. Or will he be the starter all year? That'd be a good thing, but I don't think he will be. I'm trying to man. That was, I guess, he had shoulder surgery. He had it right after the season, he right? Did. So six months. Yeah. Still not back. I don't know. I don't know. So what if 
seriously, what if Nick Foles plays very well in the first, I don't know, two or three games? What if they go 3-0 and with Nick Foles and Carson Wentz is cleared? What are you doing? Putting him back in? Probably not. Okay, it's the weight of the world's going to be on that kid's shoulders mm-hmm. to try to live up to a Super Bowl team right. when he has played zero snaps in any playoff game in his life. Well, Skip, that's the thing. Okay. Remember, this is the very situation that Tony Romo and Dak Prescott, the Cowboys, were faced with. Dak Prescott was playing unbelievable. Mm-hmm. Tony Romo was the incumbent. He was proven. He had been there for 10, 11 years. What did they do? That guy's playing too well to take him out. Tony Romo had not won a Super Bowl, hadn't even come close to playing in a Super Bowl, that's, hadn't played in an NFC Championship. Carson game. Wentz hadn't played in the Super Bowl. That's Carson's job. That's what I'm saying. The guy's playing well. It's hard. Skip, you know how superstitious coaches are. Mm-hmm. They, they do not want to upset the apple cart. Yeah. We're riding along good with this with player A, and we're winning. Even though B is the better of the two players, it's hard to put B back in over player A mm-hmm. when we're winning with player A. So you know what's going to happen. They're going to ride until Foles starts to falter a little bit. Mm-hmm. But we say, we keep saying a week or two weeks. Who knows? It might be six weeks. It might be eight weeks Could before be. uh, uh, Carson Wentz is medically cleared. Yeah. Mm-hmm. So I give you the defense, but I don't give you the offense. I think they're going to have a hard time d- depending on which quarterback is playing. As soon as Carson Wentz gets inserted in the lineup, they're going to have a hard time. Hard time doing what? Scoring. No, they won't. No, they will. Oh, they've just they, been away too. That was the number. Oh, hold up. They were like what, number two in scoring. Mm-hmm. Probably would have finished number one had Carson not got hurt. Mm-hmm. Oh, walking to him, he'd be right, mm-hmm. right back walking it to him. Fifty-yard handoffs. That's what they look like to me. You got them winning the NFC. I know who I don't Think have not. winning the NFC. Think not. I know who I not. don't have winning the NFC. Who do you? Have? I know who I don't have winning the NFC East. I, don't I, I know who I have winning the NFC East. I know you. Do. Earl Thomas's team. No, Earl no. Thomas is Seattle. Speaking mm-hmm. it into existence yeah. a little That's bit. NFC oh, yeah. West. Hmm? That's Earl NFC Thomas East. is going to win the NFC East. Mm-hmm. Yep. Hold on to it, Pete. Mm-hmm. Don't have you don't have to trade him. Yep. Here Hold we go. on. Yep. Here we go. We're good. You're good. Oh, okay, mm-hmm. you will see. Mm-hmm. <laughs> you doing all this talking now? <laughs> we'll see. Come Monday. Oh, uh, the... Cam, hit that Superman on the yep. cam. Come Monday. About two or three times. That All could right. be a problem. The last time a team did repeat as a champ was mm-hmm. 2004, and it was New England. And, hey, speaking of the Patriots, is there still turmoil with mm. them over mm. Jimmy G and his departure? We'll discuss that next. <laughs>